Yeah, no, it's a, it's a great day today to get pole position. You know, it's home home race here for the Patron Hycroft Racing Team. You know, we have a lot of Patron guests, a lot of GE guests. Um, you know, it's a, a lot of family as well, so to start up front is, is pretty good. But, uh, you know, certainly at the beginning of the of the qualifying, the rain was like absolutely tipping down. The, the GT2 guys actually sort of aborted their runs because it was so wet. And uh, it was going to be interesting to see what the officials were actually going to do in terms of whether they would cancel qualifying or they would make it continue. Um, and as it was, you know, at the, the, as we were just about to go out, you could just see the, the rain started to dissipate. And it just got, the track conditions got better and better and better. And, you know, the guys gave me a fantastic car got the quickest time, came in, there was a little bit too much understeer, a little bit too much push on the front, wasn't responding the way I wanted it, and uh, the guys made some great changes, went out, bang, pole position, and we were able to, to hold that all the way to the end, so uh, it's, it's, it's fantastic uh, for, for the team to get the pole. Uh, obviously, when, you, when you're out in qualifying, you've got to have clear running, and it's not that easy with such a short circuit like we have here at Lime Rock, so the guys were feeding me the information all the time on where all the gaps were and I had to sort of back off, back off, back off while I was out there and then I got that, that sort of last run which then gave us the, the pole position so it was a you know, great credit to these guys, I mean they're just amazing. In fact we don't actually race a lot or practice a lot in the wet, it's very rare so um, when, we, when we do it's, uh, it's a lot of fun, I actually quite enjoy it. Uh, it's a great challenge for everybody to get the maximum amount of the wet tyres, the Michelins were were definitely fantastic out there, a little tyre pressure adjustments here and there. But uh, you know, when it's really, really wet, then it starts to aquaplane, that means you've just got no contact with the tyres the on the ground. And obviously, uh, when, when you do that, uh, you're, you're basically a passenger. So uh, it could have been very tricky out there, but the weather just cleared at the right time. <laughs>